Hey everyone, welcome back. My name is Ruben. Today I'm watching The Iron Claw. So today I'm watching The Iron Claw. I don't know much about the plot, but one thing I do know is I was a young kid in the 80s and I do remember watching wrestling. And I, in the 80s, I love wrestling. I didn't even know it was not 100% real. But I did see Ben Eric Brothers. They were not thinking World Wrestling Federation when it, what it was called back then. Uh, today it's called the WWE, but back then it was WWF. They were in a different organization. So I didn't see as much of them, but they were pretty cool and they were brothers. That's it. That's all I know about this movie. The story about these brothers, I'm assuming is how they became wrestlers. I do know that Zac Efron stars in this movie. Otherwise, I'm not sure of any other actors. So I'm really looking forward to seeing this. Alrighty then, before I start, I just want to ask you one favor. If you could please subscribe, that would be a great help to my channel. Alrighty then, if you're ready to watch, listo, vamos. Inspired by true story. Okay. Okay, here's the ring and someone's being stomped on. The Iron Claw. That's the way to get him out of the corner. Uh, I guess it's not the popular guy. <laughs> uh oh, here he goes. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Oh, is that the claw? There it is. Well, I think that's the claw. Hmm, okay. This could be, yep, could be his family. Hey, Kevin. Hey, David. You crushed that guy, Pop. <laughs> oh, the Iron Claw. Mm, it is the Iron Claw. <laughs> nice to have you guys here for once. You see anything, Daddy? Uh, but it sure sounded like everyone <laughs> Yeah, they didn't seem happy. So he must play like a villain type. Where is our car? Prize. Wait. That's nice. What are you thinking? We can't afford this. Well. Apparently he can. I was talking to the promoter. Mm hmm It's gonna be fine, Dottie. I'm almost there. Almost where? We need a real house. A safe place to raise. Good points. The only way to beat it is to be the toughest, the strongest, the most successful, the absolute best. True. I will be the NWA world. NWA, yeah. I think I remember that. NWA. Put the money in. Okay, she's religious. We've been through hell, and we're gonna leave all that behind. I promise. Okay. Okay, so this must be in the future. More present day, I'm assuming. Time to get up, buddy. He looks a bit fit. <laughs> God damn. Yep. Oh. <laughs> Must be his brother. Uh, let's go for a ride. Come on, let's go. No, no, no I'm not doing that. Okay, they, they're all grown up, the kids. There's quite a few kids, four of them. Four of them. They like their guns as well. And they've been very successful. Oh, this guy's very motivated. Ever since I was a child, people said my family was cursed. Why? We never talked about it. I don't know if my brothers and I believed it back then, but bad things kept happening. Oh, no. Mom tried to protect us with God. Pop tried to protect us with wrestling. Mm, okay. He said if we were the toughest, the strongest, the most successful, nothing could ever hurt us. Possibly. I believe it. We all did. We loved our father, and we loved wrestling. Hmm. Nineteen seventy nine, okay. Whoa, Good job. Body slam. Oh, hey, he tripped him. Oh, that's a dad. Hmm, okay. Family business. Go. Good job. Oh, it's champion. The winner and the new Texas heavyweight champion, Kevin. Kevin. Congratulations, son. 
Okay. The beginning. The beginning of success, hopefully. God, he trains hard. Huh. Guys, don't you guys wear pants? Pants tomorrow. Yeah. I'm sorry, Ma, I couldn't find them. They're in the wash. Heard of it? Michael, breathe. Eat like you're a starving. <laughs> you need to bulk up, get some strength in those arms. Mike's fine, Pop. Carrie is about to become the family's first Olympian. Kevin is the NWA Texas champion. David is about to make his ring debut. Okay. So they're all accomplishing their own things. Carrie's my favorite, then Kev, then David. <laughs> but the rankings can always... Oh, really? Everyone can work their way up or down. Okay. Trying to motivate them, I suppose. Uh, Mom? Hey, Kevin. Can I talk to you about something? Baby, that's what your brothers are for. What? I know, but... I don't want to be late. What? Come on, Mom. Gotta be a little bit better listener. It's too tough on Mike. You gotta say something. Yeah, he is. Please. Kevin, that's between them. Now go get- This mom's not very supportive. Hey, how are you? How you been? Nice to okay, so she's really involved with her religion, it seems. Ah, good old garage band. <laughs> Who's in the band? Ah, that's what he wants to do. Play music. Okay. Yeah, these guys really love hanging out with each other. That's nice. We have the newly crowned Texas heavyweight champion, Kevin Von Erich here. And he's scheduled to fight in a tag team match later on tonight. But his partner is still... Oh, who's his partner? First off, I just want to say that Gino, you've been running that mouth of yours. <laughs> now I'm here to take care of it. Boy, oh boy, do I have something special for you to... Mm. Can we just... <laughs> Do it again. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> take two. And he's scheduled to fight in a tag team match against Gino Hernandez and Bruiser Brody. I just want to say that Gino, you've been shooting your mouth off way, way too long about me and my mm -hmm. family. It ain't gonna be all roses. <laughs> What's wrong? I guess that's part of the job as well. The camera work. Felicity. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Take three. Gino, you've been shooting your mouth off shooting your mouth. <laughs> you can't talk? Shit. Sorry. Ugh. If it's so easy, you get up here and do it then. Yeah, I mean, I'd love to, but it will kind of ruin this. Oh, he's a surprise. Oh, not helping. All right. Just get out of here. Too much pressure. <laughs> no, that'd be hard, though. It's hard to be in front of cameras and be spontaneous, but yet have well-rehearsed lines. Oh, so the fight's on. I'll give you a big boot. I want you to really sell it. Tag Gino in, fight him back. And I'm gonna go straight up top, so don't leave me there too long. Okay, so they're, they're figuring out their uh, game plan for how the match is gonna go. All right, David, welcome to the show. <laughs> okay, we'll see how they go. I wonder if they practice this at all. And a kick out from Gino. David picks up Gino, but he pushes it. Oh. And here comes Brody charging oh. across the line. That's where he goes up, Kevin yeah. That's right. Oh. Okay. The brothers line up a double there you go. An incredible double drop kick. Good teamwork. The claw. The iron claw. Oh. Victorious signature move. Oh, and he slaps it on Gino. Wow, okay. The pain is too much. Gino taps out at the Bonner twin. Look out. And the WA David and Kevin Bonner are here. Kevin there you go. They're groupies, fans. Hi, Kevin. Can I get your autograph? Sure. Oh, don't you want to ask me who to make it out to? Yeah, that would be good. Oh, yeah. Sure. It's Pam. You're supposed to say nice to meet you. <laughs> I think Kevin's a little bit uh, shy. I'm sorry. Uh, it is nice to meet you, Pam. <laughs> it's nice to meet you, too, Kevin. I think she wants to get to know you. Your folks not teach you how to ask questions. <laughs> like what? Like or... Would you like to have a drink with me sometime, Pam? Mm. <laughs> Are you asking me? No, yeah. Make me feel a little worse. Because you're not. I would love to go out with you, Pam. Well, hopefully it'll go well. And then no one else will have the chance to ask you again. Really? Okay. And somebody called me from over at ESPN. They want to offer us a national slot for Saturday nights. Oh, really? That's great news. Sounds like it. If we perform and we have a World Heavyweight Champion in our roster, we could be the biggest promotion. Oh, place. okay. Oh, we'll have a world heavyweight champion. I can promise you that. Let's move forward. Okay, he's made it to the date. So, what do you want in life, Kevin? Mm, okay. 
Deep questions. More ribs. <laughs> More ribs. I want to be world heavyweight champion. Mm. And I'll just fake. Fake. Oh, she called him out. There's nothing fake about world. You move up in any industry based on your performances, right? Mm -hmm. A belt, like my Texas title, is really just a job promotion. Okay. If you do well, you become world champ as a reward because you're the best based on your ability. Mm hmm and on how the crowd responds. Okay, yeah. And is that all you want? No, of course not. I want to be with my family. Mm. You know, be with my brothers. Mm. That's sweet. These guys are very close. Just being together, we can do anything. Together, they're stronger. What about you? There you go. Well, I want to be a vet. I want kids. I want my own practice. I want a man who's okay with that. Mm -hmm. So would you be okay with that? <laughs> oh, damn right. <laughs> damn. We could be one of those modern super couples. Mm -hmm. Everyone could come live with us. All my brothers, their <laughs> families. Okay. I think she wants her own life. You know, you have oldest brother syndrome. Yeah, you want to take care of everyone. Maybe. I'm not the oldest, though. When I was five, my big brother, Jack Jr., he died. Mm. Oh, my God, Kevin, I'm so sorry. I had no idea. That's all right. And I don't really think about it. Okay. So I'm not the oldest. I must have the... Uh, Second oldest. The second old yeah. Oh, should I give him a hug? Yeah. <laughs> she seems nice. I'm so sorry. Will they end up together? It's a part of the family curse. Family curse? Here we go again. My dad changed his last name to Vonale. Oh. Which was my grandma. Okay. And I don't know, I guess her family had all sorts of tragedy. So when my brother died, people started saying that it was his curse. Hmm. Interesting. But I don't believe in any of that. I know it was all just bad luck. Yeah, possibly. I don't believe in curses. And I don't believe in luck. I think we make our own luck. That's true, too. Hey, Pop. Get in here. <laughs> Big news. Okay. Some good news? I booked Harley Race to come to the Sportatorium. You are going to fight the world heavyweight. Huh? No way. Your first match will be a non-title fight, but if you put a whooping on him and show the world who you are, you will become the number one contender. Okay. And get your title shot. Well, that's good. Thank you. I, I will make you so proud. I've dreamed of having that belt in this house my whole hmm, life. Really? But the NWA never gave me the chance I deserved. But they always robbed me at the last minute. Sounds a little bit bitter. You can be the one to bring it home for us. No pressure. So how do they decide it's his turn to move on or not? Hmm. I feel the excitement here at the world. Okay, let's see how it goes. Kevin Bonerick faces his biggest challenge to date. Four-time world champion, the indomitable Harley Race. Harley Race looks a little bit older. A lot older. And they lock up. Oh. Not a great start for the young man looking to make an impression. Okay. Kevin on the map. He's oh, he blocked it. Yeah, he didn't fall. Okay, that time he did. Oh! Oh, I don't think the ref saw that. Okay. Before a ride. Oh, and he tosses Kevin over the top rope. My goodness, Kevin crashes down on the concrete floor. Concrete. That would hurt a little bit still. Oh, no! On the concrete? Oh. He looks like he's hurt, hurt. Damn. Is he hurt for real? Come on, get up. Get up. Get up, get up, get up. Oh my god, he's gonna be counted out, I think. He made it in, he made it in. But he seems hurt. For real, I don't know. <laughs> oh, that's. That would hurt still, right? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Hmm. Oh, no. Hey! What the heck? Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh, this is brother. Okay. Get out of here. Okay. How dare you to come back in? How dare you? Harley Race, you 
you, coward. Afraid I was gonna beat you. You Harley Race, tonight we showed you what we're made of. You came into our building, and my brother here put a good old fashioned Texas whooping on you. <laughs> you okay. are the past, my friend. Mm -hmm. We're the future of this sport, so you keep on running. There you go. My oh. brother here deserves his rematch. Yeah. And he will fight you anywhere, anytime, for a fair shot at that NWA World Heavyweight title. There you go. Ooh, he is injured. Is that angry? You were long getting up. Yeah, I just never hit the floor that hard. Mm, damn. You gotta take it and get up. Hmm. Okay, but it still hurts, dude. He wasn't supposed to throw me out the ring. Caught me off guard. I physically, I just couldn't move. Hmm, but you did. That's how they test you. But you did. Did I do enough to get my rematch? Of course you did. We'll see. Hmm? Those rap bastards will use any excuse they can to screw us over. Oh, really? David, great on the mic, son. Hmm. Really great. We'll get you out on the road. Get you some more exposure. Okay. Dad's down playing it because he doesn't want to get your hopes up. But you were incredible out there. Why didn't you let me talk? You should have let me talk. Yeah, hmm. I'm sorry, Kev. I thought I was helping. He was trying to help, Kevin. Trying to protect you. Heavyweight champion out there. By disqualification. <laughs> but it's a start. This could be the other brother. Is this the carry guy they mentioned earlier? Uh, what is happening here? Anything? Everything okay? The principles and the quality of the Olympics, not destroying it. Oh. That we and other nations who believe in freedom and who believe in human rights, let our voices be heard in an absolutely clear way. Hmm. Right. Okay. For the sacrifice that you'll have to make this summer in not going to Moscow. Oh, so the U.S. That's the year the U.S. didn't go to the Olympics. Yeah, I remember now. Moment. So his brother's dream. Brother, Damn. Ours will not go. Is that the curse, or has I just been unlucky? Oh, okay. They got a welcome home banner. Welcome home, Kerry. I think that's his dad's favorite, right? <laughs> Sorry, it didn't work out, Pop. Oh, not your fault. You can't control that, buddy. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> Look at you! That's so cool to have a close family. <laughs> okay, they're very competitive family. I saw a new show pop. It's great. I was real proud watching you fight Harley, Kev. Thanks, Gary. Now when's the rematch? Mm. Uh, I'm not sure yet. We just haven't got the call. Yeah. Okay. Hey, how's the music coming, Mike? Hey, what do you play? Lots of things: um, viola, violin, piano. Other instruments. Guitar. <laughs> Met your father. He was classically trained on the clarinet. Oh wow! Had a music scholarship to University of Texas. There you go. He gave it up to play football at Southern Methodist. Mm, wow. No future in music. No future in music. I been meaning to tell everyone. I, it's gonna tell him. We ha we actually have a gig. Michael, that's great. Whim. That's the thing. It, it's it's rock music. Dallas. Oh, you're too young to set foot on a university campus. What? Ma. Kev went on national tour at 17. That was for work. Yeah. Your mom said no. no. What? This is work. We're, we're getting paid. They're getting paid. That's work. I mean, we could take him. Yeah, the brothers. The answer is no. Uh, come on, mom. Well, <laughs> yeah, let's get out of there. Sneak out. Parents can be too strict sometimes. Oh, guys, don't make so much noise. <laughs> Careful. Hope the dad doesn't find out. Well, the car, they're going to hear the car make noise. Oh, Pam's along with the ride. Oh, okay. Good idea, good idea, good idea. Oh, the brothers? Yeah, 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 yeah. Good, good. Okay. Let's see how good the brother is at music. Okay. It's good. Brothers are proud. These guys probably don't get too many opportunities because the parents are so strict. Okay, will he get his title shot? Oh, Ric Flair got the shot? Hmm, didn't give it to him. Damn, he ain't too happy. Gary. Yes, sir. I don't know if you've been thinking about your future, but you should think about wrestling. What? But the Olympics has been taken from you. The way professional football was taken from me. All right. The world keeps taking from us. 
and I'm sick of it. I want to fight back. And the more of us in it together, the better. Okay. I want you to join your brothers in the ring. Hmm. Yes, sir. I love that. Well, okay. That was easy. So now we got three Von Erics in wrestling. Except for him. He loves his music. Ah, oh, that became their uh, theme song. Three against three. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> wow. These guys are determined. Oh, they're taking a bit of uh, drugs. Freebirds, ever since you've arrived, bully and cheat your way to victory, and we're so good. Oh. It's about filth versus decency, and you know it. Uh, <laughs> Fun book. The hands that were passed down to us, the hands that were delivered the iron claw to you. Oh, <laughs> the iron claw. Hmm, David's getting famous as well. Welcome to WCCW. Mm. The only promotion being broadcast worldwide. Okay, this must be a big shot. And the challengers. Devon Eriks. Free Birds versus Devon Eriks. 1983. Gordy kicks out and Hayes elbows his own man. Kerry moving out of the way just in time. All hell. Okay. Kerry off the ropes with a cross. Oh. What's he going to do with him? Here comes David, a drop kick. Kerry falls on Gordy, and that's it. Job. Good job, guys. NWA World Six Man Tag Team Champions, Kevin Kerry and David Von Good job. Pretty good. We're champions now. I will make it my life's work to see to it that David Von Erich will be the next NWA World Heavyweight Champion. David. And then each and every one of my sons. Not Kevin? Starting with Kevin, then Kerry, then Mike. Hey, Mike's like, what? <laughs> Mike's like, what, me? Congratulations, boys. I'm sure he doesn't mean me first. Mm. Pop doesn't make mistakes like that. Hmm. Damn. Is there a problem? Yeah. Yes, there is. No, sir. Damn. So he got sidestepped by his brother, thanks to his dad. These fights do take the good toll on them. It is a rough business. I've got good news. We are finally getting a world heavyweight title shot with Ric Flair. Wow, it's Ric Flair. And they want it to be you, David. Mm-hmm. Don't look to your brother. Oh, damn. You'll go on the road and feud with Flair in every territory in America over the next six months. Then you'll go to Japan. Japan. You'll be world champion unless you win over Japan. Oh, okay. And you'll fight with Flair at Parade of Champions in May at Texas Stadium. Wow. Are you up for it? Of course I am. Love you, Pop. There you go. I've waited my whole life to have that belt. <laughs> it's not about you, dude. It's not about the dad. The title will be ours. Ours is it's David's. And your collective effort has pushed him to the top. Hmm. You never know when your opportunity will come. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Well, it should have been Kevin's opportunity, not David's. Okay. Gotta be happy for your brother. But I guess he feels a little bit like a failure. Kevin does. Oh, okay. He got married, though. That's good. <laughs> okay. At least they're happy. That's good. Good. Too much already? It's early. Mm, damn. Someone's really sick. Who is it? Shit, brother. You all right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we uh, just some stomach cramps. Ugh. Wait, is this blood? Jesus, man. You need to see a doctor. No, I'm fine. You're not fine. Hmm. Doesn't look good. Maybe you're pushing too hard. You need to rest. Hmm. I'm almost there. You think it's gonna slow down when you become world champion? Mm, true. I'll be good. I don't think you should go to Japan next week. Oh, I, he, might ha he might have to. His dad's gonna give him a chance. I just wanna say, 
I didn't take it so well. You jumped me and all. Mm, being honest. I got pretty angry. Not at you, just at the whole situation. Of course you would. You love the world. Wrestling world. You man, married two hours and already losing your competitive edge. I'll be pretty happy to focus on my family, though. Mm, that's good. Something to look forward to. Turns out there's a shotgun with you rat bastard. <laughs> <Don't tell> <laughs> Damn it, Kev. Okay, his wife's pregnant. You gonna be an uncle? Yes, sir. <laughs> Let's see what's next for the brothers. Well, David's gonna go to Japan. Huh? Mm, what's wrong? Huh, what is it? David. What happened? That's sick or what? He died in his hotel room in Japan. Oh, no, no, no. A ruptured intestine. Oh, man. No. Hmm. Take those sunglasses off. What? They're sad, man. No hiding. I don't want to see any tears. What? The Lord decided it was time for David to move on. That's not how life is. You have to express your emotions. It's a very sad occasion. Of course they have to be emotional. Oh, it's a postcard from Japan. Could that be David's last postcard? Kev, I miss you, brother. You gotta come with me next time. It's wild over here. Mm. Someone asked me for an autograph today because they thought I was you. Oh, wow. It made me very happy. Damn, look at that. I'll probably be home by the time you get this, so this is stupid, but just wanted to send. Mm. See you soon. Mm. I'm here if you want to talk. Good. It's hard to see clearly in this dark moment. Sure is. Definitely. But we cannot let this tragedy define us. Our greatness will be measured by our response to adversity. Now, David's title match against Ric Flair at Parade of Champions is a moment of a lifetime. Hmm? Okay, but it's over. We still have a chance to bring the World Heavyweight Championship home if one of you will step up and wrestle in his place. What? His son just died. I'll do it. I can do it, Dad. I can do it, too. Oh. Carrie. I'll do it. I'm ready, Dad. Hey! It should you don't be. Have to. It's Kevin's. It's my match. No, I deserve it too, boys. What, guys? You are the oldest, Kev. But Carrie's been getting the most heat lately. What? We're gonna flip a coin. Flip a coin? It's the only fair way to decide. That's fair. Heads for Carrie. Kevin's done a lot more work. Tails for Kevin. A lot more time in the business. So who gets it? Carrie gets it. It should be Kevin. That's twice now. Wow. They're watching it at home on the TV. I wonder if that's the real footage. So Carrie won. Wow. Oh, his father got what he wanted. The champion, the championship belt. The world championship belt. Oh, Kevin. I didn't know you were still here. Mm. Here's something, Pop. Mm. How you doing? I'm having trouble coming down. What do you mean? Yeah, a bit. I can't believe it's finally in our family. It is. It should be Kevin's. It's my thoughts. Definitely. You know what I think? I'm going to go for a ride or something. Dude, you had a few beers. Damn. Okay. And he leaves the belt there for him to look at. Great. World's heavyweight champion. I got a bad feeling about this. I got a bad feeling. Very bad feeling. Ow. Oh, he had an accident. Hmm. Okay. Uh, what is he doing? Oh, dude. Don't do drugs. 
How's his father gonna respond to this? Oh crap! Oh crap, his leg, his foot! Oh man, this family is cursed. Is everything correct? Actually, his last name will be Atkinson. Oh, he's changing the name. Does it feel cursed? Let me update it and I'll be right back. Oh my god, but I get I would too. Are you sure you want to do that? It feels cursed. <laughs> I just don't feel safer for him, I think. Hmm, damn. Don't cross your damn Oh, he's getting into it now too? Yep, stand tall, use your height. Yeah, he's tall. <laughs> Hey, that doesn't mean anything, all right? Twist it again. Make it mean something. <laughs> Ouch! Headlock. Okay, so he's training his youngest brother. Oh, he's, he's in it. Damn. Oh. Okay. <laughs> He's fighting. <laughs> Amazing. Oh. Oh, there you go. Oh, damn. Oh, three drop kicks. Oh, what happened? Oh, no, he hurt himself. Damn it. Damn, everything's... Going to hell. <laughs> like, not working out. What's happening? We completed the surgery as planned. Okay. We repaired the shoulder, but it was trickier than we anticipated. Right. Mike's temperature skyrocketed. What? We worked really hard to bring it down, but it was close to 107. For Four. Okay. We believe you suffered toxic shock syndrome. No. What does that mean? No. I'm sorry to say that Mike is in a coma. Oh, man. All we can do now is wait and pray he pulls through. This wrestling thing is... Oh, terrible. Why does this happen to us? Mm. Why does it just keep happening? Okay, baby. Stay with me, okay? But it keeps happening. Damn. It's taking over. Terrible accident. Mentally so hard to see this happen to your family. It's not your fault. If you want to blame someone, you blame your father. Yep. The father pushes him into it. Hmm. Happy now, Father? Jeez. And thank you for all the love. Oh, okay. He's out of the coma. We're all just so excited that Mike pulled through. Shows how much of a fighter he is. After losing David, it's just... It's too much to think that we almost lost Mike, too. Oh, my gosh. Uh, I'm moved that... Uh, my whole family is here. Hmm. Through everything, and... Uh, does he need to do a press conference? So what's the time frame for your return to the ring, Mike? Return to the ring? This guy's injured. Soon, yeah. Soon. Mike's a fighter more than people even realize, I think. And he's gonna be back in the ring in no time. Damn. His family suffering, suffering and suffering. That's like the fourth brother because they had another brother, the oldest, that passed away a long time ago. Oh, wow. Is it time to retire from wrestling, guys? Okay. So Kevin's still fighting. Has a new partner. Tag him. Tag him in. Oh, he's taking all the glory, this guy. Mm-hmm. Damn, he's not in it anymore. <laughs> Retired, I think. It's not your world anymore. He must feel a bit alone, obviously. These brothers are so close. Like it's a family. Hmm. Okay, yeah, he's just walking and he has to. He has to try to get back to normal life. Youngest should have been a. I'm scared, Ma. Of going back in the ring. God loves you, Michael. There's nothing to be scared of. 
Don't blink too much on that. Everybody wants me to be David, but mm. can't replace him. Yeah. That's what he should be doing, playing music. See, so feeling the pressure as well. Oh no, 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 guys, guys, guys. Oh my gosh! No. This is not gonna be good. Oh, Carrie's not gonna be able to fight with, with, a, with a bad leg. Yeah. There's no way. We can't rush this. It's gonna take time, Carrie. I don't think it's I don't think it's possible. I'm trying to tell you to slow down. Hmm. Maybe you should do something else with your life. Yeah. 110%. You want back in? Then get up. There's no way you can fight with one leg or one foot. There's no way. Hey, where are you going? I'm sorry if I hurt you, but I'm going to a better place. No, oh, no, 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 no! This can't be! <sighs> Don't tell me. No, they're cursed, but wrestling's not for them. It's not for them. Today we are here. Terrible, 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 terrible. The wife's taking it hard, but I'm sure he's in shock. Are you coming home tonight? I don't know. What do you mean it's a no? I'm not sure. Um, I know how painful this is. I do. And I'm trying to be patient. But this, this doesn't work for me. Hmm? I know. I'm home. All right, just be with us. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> To get it. Oh God, Kevin, you can't be serious. I'm sorry. Just, I'm sorry. You still need to be around your son. I guess so it's gonna destroy your marriage as well. Damn. Taking his frustration out, his anger, sadness, grief. He sleeps there. Instead of being at home? At least get a nice bed or something, or sofa. Ever since I was a child, people said my family was cursed. Hmm. It never seemed to worry my father. Hmm. He said if we were the toughest, the strongest, the toughest, the most successful, the most successful, the, the absolute, absolute best, nothing could ever hurt us. Hmm. So, he was wrong. This match is scheduled for one fall. And it's for the NWA World Heavyweight. Wow, he is getting a shot. There's been a lot of talk that you've been resisting coming down to the Sportatorium to defend your title against Kevin Von Erich. It is so hard to be humble when you're looking like Ric Flair. <laughs> yeah, Ric Flair used to be so cocky. Kevin, your daddy got together with the powers that be and ordered me back down here to tell. Oh, wow. No daddy's boy is going to take that from me. Mm -hmm. This is professional wrestling. He had a lot of flair. <laughs> 1986. Hope Kevin wins. Can't believe he's still in wrestling. That's crazy. Oh, starts. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, he used to do that. Oh, okay. Eric just wants to beat him up. Oh. What's going on in his head? Is something going on? Something's wrong? The claw. Okay. Oh. Oh, he's not gonna stop. He's gonna get disqualified. Oh man. By disqualification and still in WA World Heavyweight Champion. 
Wow. Ric Flair! Kevin Von Erich has been yeah. disqualified. Wow. I think you're supposed to do that. What the fuck happened, kid? He just want to be in it anymore, I don't think. Oh man, you look crazy. <laughs> you look crazy. You were one crazy son of a bitch. I mean, I always thought you were a little soft, but baby, you got it. Mm -hmm. I'll give you a rematch any day. Let's get a drink. Oh, I'm, I'm good. Thanks. Okay, awkward a little bit. Hang on, I'm just gonna have to. Hmm. Is he coming back? <laughs> Oh, we got two sons! Or, I think sons. Two kids. <laughs> I got two dogs as well. I have one more piece of broccoli. <laughs> oh, great. Yuck. <laughs> we need to make a change. Okay. What do you change? Moving somewhere else? <laughs> Wait, is he now running the business? So what did you decide, boss? I don't think we need to cut down again to one show. Oh. Two still too many. That sounds painful, but smart. He's the boss. Wow. Just haven't been there since Kerry went to the WWF. Oh, he did? Jerry called again this morning. It's a good offer. We should think about it. He did? How did Kerry get back? So... We have an offer on the table from Jerry Jarrett. He wants to buy us out. Son, I didn't give you the company so you could turn around and sell it. Hey. I need to think about my family, Dad. Hmm, definitely. I'm almost broke. We need a house. We can't fit in that apartment anymore. If you sell, you can forget about stepping through these doors again. Oh. Great. It's 40 years old, still can't take care of yourself. Oh, dude, don't be an asshole. I've been through the books. It doesn't add up. I didn't make nearly what it says I did. Hmm. I did what was right all along. Hmm? You think living here was a free ride? Don't you dare question me. Dude, were you corrupt a little bit or a lot? Two, three, yes! a boy, Carrie. That's how you do it. Look at your uncle, boys. How did Kerry do it? I can't understand his foot. He was missing a foot. He looks strong, son. WWF Intercontinental Champion. Second biggest title in wrestling since your brother ruined our promotion. Hey, what an asshole. Now come tell me, when are you getting your world title shot over there? Mm. I see your old tag team partner, Hellwig's holding. That guy's got nothing on you, never has. Oh, so, so love him, so. Hmm. I hey. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited to be home. Yeah, see. See. Hey. Hmm. You okay? Yeah. 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 Never been better. Hmm. Okay. Sounds good. They seem okay. Oh, there's no more tragedy in this family, but I doubt it. Hello. Oh, hey. Good, good. You still up? It's Carrie? Well, he's not up. He was asleep. <laughs> Where are you? Well, I'm in some hotel in Dallas. Dallas. Why didn't you go home? You okay? No, I'm scared, man. Why are you scared? Oh, I'm scared. I'm out of control. Oh, no. What is it, man? What's happening? I'm in pain all the time. I'm fucking deformed. It takes too much to hide it. Oh, man. Is it showing the ring? They're not giving me a new contract. Oh. Got me in house shows from now on. Oh wow, okay. Is that like a demotion? Well, I got I got nowhere to go. I got no one. Well, where's Tonya? Who? She wasn't with him? I need someone. No, I need family. Just come here. Stay with us. No, I can't. I can't let your boy see me like this. Hmm. <sighs> Kiri, just tell me where you are. Yeah, I don't do anything stupid, buddy. And I'll come and get you. Oh, man. Dad, I'm sorry for the early call. It's okay. Hey, I just talked to Carrie. It's not good. I'm worried about him. Mm. I'm going to come out there. We need to figure out how to help him, okay? Mm. Yep. You always need to work it out between yourselves. What? Just look out for him. 
Okay, Dad. I'll be there as soon as I can. This father sucks. <laughs> oh, crap. Wow. No, no, no. Who shot? Who shot? Somebody shot somebody. What's going on here? Carrie? No. Uh -oh. Terrible. I told you to look out for him. No. Yeah. You didn't take care of him. Hmm. Don't any of them. He called you, and you didn't help him. You. What? <laughs> this is a very tragic story. Henry was so, 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 so tragic. That's the third brother, fourth, with the one that we never met. I don't know what's on the other side, but I can't be here anymore. Tonight I walk with my brothers. Mmm, terrible. This is too much to take for Kevin. Mmm, how's this gonna affect Kevin? Just so you know, your dad called me out to his ranch. Tried to intimidate me out of buying this from you. Oh. No, he never stops. I'll give you a minute. Damn, yeah, he had to. He has to leave that life behind. It was a cursed life. I hope he lived a longer life than his brothers. I hope so. Oh, she's pregnant again. I think. <laughs> I think. <laughs> Careful! We want pancakes. Mm -hmm. How about a good morning? Good morning. Good morning. Well, he has, he has family that he can keep him going to be there for them. Marshall. Oh, God, he's crying. Probably remembers when he had his brothers and playing with his brothers. Marshall. They're going to ask him why he's crying. You okay, Dad? Lee, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, boys. You shouldn't see me like this. Man doesn't cry. Oh, he does. It's okay, Dad. You can cry. Everyone mm. cries. Yeah. Yeah, what are you talking about? You cry all the time. <laughs> yeah. Do you think you know why you're sad? Hmm. Well, I guess it's because I used to be a brother. Hmm. He has no brothers. I'm not a brother anymore. You're still a brother. We'll be your brothers, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be your brothers. Yeah. That's so nice. Oh, <laughs> Peace, brothers. Thank you. Good kids. Good kids. Yeah, cry, dude. <sighs> Thank you, boys. What a tough life. What a tough life. But like I said, at least he has the sons. Wow, to the Hall of Fame. Hmm. Oh, good, 40 years. <laughs> wow. Look at that. <laughs> That's awesome. Wow, the whole family lives together. That's crazy. Wow. That was a very sad story. The Von Erics definitely had, I don't know if they were cursed, but they definitely had a very tough life. Very tough life. Crazy. Um, the father obviously was, wanted to be world champion. And so I guess you could say his father lived his life through the kids, through the young brothers. But that's too much pressure. I don't know, I guess those kids just listened to the father, they were very respectful to the father. But I guess I think they didn't get a chance to live their own lives. And obviously also the wrestling industry is a very high pressure industry. I read articles of other wrestlers that I grew up with as well that also, you know, had really tough lives. It was just 
the, the deluxe didn't end well either. So it's uh, really sad to see that, but uh, it was a really good movie, actually. Very sad movie, which I hate, but that's life sometimes. I'm glad that at least Kevin kept on uh, having more kids, having a bigger family, and he's still alive, it seems like, today. So that's excellent. But it was very unfortunate for all the brothers to be involved in that industry. And I guess the mom also did not provide much, much, much support. Zac Efron did a great job. He did really well. I do remember when I was young seeing Kevin Banerick fighting and his brothers. Not too much because like I said they weren't like, like they showed in the movies. They weren't shown in national televised programming as much because they had a much smaller like little organization. But I did see him fight and it was pretty cool. And I do remember Kevin being barefoot, which was crazy. And I do also now do remember the claw. So, wow, very tragic. Um, I guess can't see much else. It, it finally got me in the end. I got the feels. I got some tears in my eyes just when Kevin realized that, you know, his family's gone. There's nothing like family, no matter what. So it's very important to support your family. All right, and that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed my reaction. Uh, please uh, subscribe. That would help me out so much. And thank you, everyone, for uh, uh, subscribing. I hope you already subscribed to my channel. Thank you so much. Uh, please leave a comment. Tell me what you thought when you saw the movie. And let me know if you remember seeing these guys when you were younger uh, wrestling a swollen TV, which was back in the day. <laughs> so not everyone's going to be able to remember that. I don't know. All right, then. That's it for tonight. Okay. Bye.